outfit of the day. What's up, dudes? Okay, today we have to treat, um, I know we have to treat some bulls, I think. I think it's just the bulls. They have hoof rot, so we're gonna go up and treat them. And I've actually never seen this done either. So it's gonna be an adventure for the whole family here. Louie, chill, you're fine. Just chill, bud. Jake, oh. you excited? There's all my stuff I'm bringing, all my GoPro stuff, my coffee, and my water. The boys and I are currently at a place called Bizman Auto Works. My dad's pickup is having some work done on it. I don't know. Uh, I just had my mom drive down, so I'm sure she's looking for parking. This area is so packed full of vehicles, but so after like we're done here getting my mom, we're gonna go and pick up some corn, so that way we can bring all the cows into the curls and stuff when we get up to my brother's. Hi, uh, me from the future. So in this next part, it's going to look like we're using a real gun. I don't know how sensitive YouTube is about like me saying that. Uh, it's gonna look like a real gun. I promise you it is not. It's just a dart gun. So that way, instead of putting the cattle through the stress of like getting them back in the corrals or like having to haul them and put them through the chutes and stuff. Uh, this is a much more like stress-free way of giving them a shot. We just shoot them with a dart gun. It honestly, I think it just feels like a person getting a shot. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know ahead of time that there will be a little bit like of a gun sighting. Um, I don't know what the correct way is to put that, but um, we're not hurting them. 
we're making them feel better. This is how we are going to prevent um, hoof rot disease. It, that caused them a lot of pain. And later on, I have more clips of um, one of the Hereford bulls walking and he is in a lot of pain. So we are trying very hard to keep them healthy and happy and not in pain. So I promise you, it's gonna look like we're gonna unalive them, but we are not, That that is not our plan. So just fair warning though, um, trigger warning, just so you guys know, okay? So if you're kind of sensitive to the sight of guns and stuff, maybe fast forward a bit. <laughs> See, that one that got the shot, you can hardly even tell which one it is in that group because she hardly made a fuss. So, I promise, they're all safe. <laughs> yeah, he's coming up. Slow but sure. You can really see here how he's struggling to walk with that back left leg. That's when that's for fraud. One dart was a. Uh... Can you kind of explain like what hoof rot is and what you're doing to treat it? Hoof rot is usually a disease or uh, an infection in the hoof or the bottom of the foot that they um, that they get from a nail puncture. Sometimes it's in the soil. Sometimes it's just a variation. Sometimes they get bottom of their feet. They get ulcers on the bottom of their feet if their toes split. And it's an infection that just is in some ground that the ground just carries and they, they kind of spread it from pasture to pasture wherever they, they go at times. But I don't know what scientific is about it. I don't know much. Last time did it, so I'm gonna have to take this. Did they, um, did you see that other one fall out yet? Uh -oh. So what I picked up, I just threw in these, um, feed bunks or whatever, feed troughs. Tell me how big this barn is. It's really cool in here. Yeah, I was gonna put this out of the way, but there's a huge cold in here. I was double checking each step before I went up it just to make sure that it wasn't gonna give under my weight before I went up. But how amazing is the loft of this barn? A wedding would be gorgeous here if the floor could hold up. <laughs> that was in the barn that was from one petition to another that a bunch of us had carved our initials on. He took that door, he made a bathroom in the basement, put it on the barn door hinge, and used that door for the really? bathroom door. She still tried to get up even more, but she got me in the back. So Mom and I did come home, but now we are gonna take Lizzie to the vet. 
Thank you, Lizzie. She's got an Ellie on her leg. Well, she broke her leg. Lizzie. All right, so we're gonna take her to the vet and get her all checked out. The patient's still a little out of it. So that clip that I got with my phone is the only clip I got of Lizzie at the vet. I was gonna try to get some video of her getting her leg x-rayed for you guys, but holy cow, for some reason, I started to get like extremely sweaty, but my body was just like freezing cold, but I was sweating. So I don't know, it must have been seeing her leg and stuff. I didn't want to show that. Um, It wasn't the prettiest sight, but I've broken a bunch of bones in my own life. So I guess my body still gets freaked out by seeing broken bones and stuff. But anyway, that's it for me today. That was our day. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give the video a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And as long as you're doing that, you should turn on my post notifications as well. I try very hard to post something for you guys every single day. But with that, I will see you back here again tomorrow. Bye.